Today is Monday, May 5th. Other known as a single mile. Do you know what this means? This means that today is Cinco de Mayo. Yeah. Yes, it is. And why is it Cinco de Mayo, Chris? And why is it such an important day? Uh, here is a short historical fact about Cinco de Mayo. You know what? I'm going I'm to read it. No, you know, you're not. <laughs> the, histor the holiday of Cinco de Mayo, the 5th of May, which is known as, commemorates the victory of the Mexican militia over the French <laughs> army at the Battle of Pueblo in 1862. That's it a is long a primary, time ago. It's primarily a regional a holiday, holiday celebrated in the Mexican state capital city of Pueblo and throughout the state of Pueblo with the some limited recognition in other parts of Mexico and especially in U.S. cities. With a significant Mexican population, it is not as many people think Mexico's Independence Day, which is actually September 16th. Today for lunch we are having meatballs, mashed potatoes, and corn. You should be having tacos today. <laughs> Alternative mini corn dog. Today will be another beautiful Florida day with a high of 85 degrees, with 100% of rain. Nice I'm just nice kidding. Things. We have zero percent <laughs> chance of rain. Boys and girls. With winds. Well, the winds will be coming from northeast at 14 miles per hour. That is pretty fast, huh? Super fast. Can pick me up and Every throw me. Psych. All right. Boys and girls will have five, five weeks, weeks left before, before summer vacation. vacation. Time, Time is literally flying, flying by. by. Time is flying by, guys. I remember last year I was in my diapers. Diapers? Me too. It's but it depends, like adult diapers, not kid diapers. You're not an adult though. Alright, well, here is Tunia with some sports. The Marlins won yesterday, they beat the Los Angeles Dodgers. Okay. And the Heat are starting a new series against the Brooklyn Nets at the American Airlines Arena. Good luck guys. They're on their way to another NBA championship. This week is a teacher appreciation week, so let's be extra good to them teachers, you know? This Friday is May crowning. <laughs> Which is brought to us by the 8th grade class. I was brought to you by 8th grade On class. On Saturday, May 10th, our 2nd graders will be receiving their first Holy Communion. Holy moly, Chris! Isn't that, is that crazy? Very holy moly, indeed. Wow. Well, good luck to 2nd grade. And we are going to be praying for you guys this week and every other week. Well, right. that's, easy. that's easy for us today, Jesus. We'll see you see guys you tomorrow. here tomorrow morning. He's Chris. Have an amazing single to mile. I'm Chris. He's Julian. And, and we are out.